If you were to travel 75 miles west from Lahore, through the beautiful agricultural district of Sheikhapura, where fresh air and sprawling vistas are a welcome change from the crowded hustle and bustle of urban life, you would arrive at Sangala Hill. Upon making your final approach to the city, the origins of the name Sangala Hill would become very apparent as you are greeted by a giant rock monolith that towers over the surrounding landscape. Over 200,000 people live in the main city center and surrounding countryside, where wheat harvesting is a primary occupation for livelihood. These crops are then brought into the marketplace where they are sold alongside fruits, animals, spices, cleaning products, clothing, and household appliances. The PEB Higher Secondary School and Boarding House in Sangala Hill was established at the dawn of the 20th century in 1902 by missionaries under the United Presbyterian Church of North America. And for 70 years, the school's aim to provide quality education to the boys and girls of Sheikhapura was continually achieved. Unfortunately, in January of 1972, Christian schools were nationalized and assumed under the authority of the Pakistani government. And for 26 years, our school and boarding house in Sangala Hill were heavily neglected while existing in this nationalized state. When PEB finally regained control in 1998, the property had been left in a deplorable condition. A portion of the boarding house had even collapsed and was unsafe for occupancy. Clearly, much repair and renovation work was needed. By God's grace, a new boarding house was constructed and dedicated in April of 2001 by the Presbyterian Women USA through their birthday offering. And throughout the next 20 years, additional projects have been completed. Phase one of our school building was funded by our Dutch friends from the Oikonomos Foundation in 2005. While phase two was funded by the Eads Foundation in Champaign, Illinois, along with additional funds from First Presbyterian Church in Champaign, Illinois. The school building was dedicated in 2014, providing high quality education to the poorest of the poor. As we arrive at the PEB Higher Secondary School in Sangala Hill, we see that students coming in the mornings are observing strict COVID SOPs, like hand sanitizing and temperature checks. For the students who remain on campus in our boarding house, they begin every morning with a time of worship and prayer together. After breakfast and devotions have concluded, the students line up single file and move as one group from the boarding house to the school to begin their daily studies. The school offers every student activity-based learning. This means that boys and girls have the privilege to enjoy intentional participation in the learning experience, rather than merely being passive listeners and observers. Parent-teacher meetings are also conducted on a monthly basis to provide regular updates to parents on the progress of their children. Our teachers are also given refresher courses throughout the year under the supervision of foreign qualified staff. This state-of-the-art computer lab was given in honor of U.S. Navy veteran Corwin Michael Frank, who passed away in September of 2011 at the age of 21. The school has a beautiful architectural design with modern classrooms, polished and clean walkways, and a spacious courtyard. We owe a tremendous debt of gratitude to the numerous individuals and organizations such as Oikonomos Foundation and the Eads Foundation for the gracious and generous financial gifts they have given over the years. 
These gifts make it possible even for us to provide education to the highest levels of student age, such as grades 11 and 12. These girls will now have the opportunity to pursue quality, professional careers after they have graduated. The school has a well-equipped science lab, which provides highest quality education possible. Education that is responsive to the needs of individuals as we prepare them for the unique challenges of life in the 21st century. The school is also equipped with modern facilities like multimedia, which enables students to learn through watching interactive videos. Thank you for using your monetary resources to impact hundreds of lives every year in a country that is thousands of miles away from your homeland. We are also pleased to announce that over the last decade, test scores have continued to improve. And every year, we have some of the strongest academic results of any school in Sangla Hill. We also focus on the personal growth of our students by offering them co-curricular activities, which gives them a chance to develop their social skills, meet new friends, and become more confident working together in groups. As we look ahead to the future of the PEB Higher Secondary School in Sangala Hill, our next major goal is to provide a separate high school academic block for boys. As per government regulations, boys and girls need to study in separate classes after grade 5. And currently there are 200 boys attending the school in Sangala Hill. This new building phase will allow 500 boys to come every day and study in our school. Would you consider donating to this cause? Would you consider giving out of the surplus that God has given you to make a positive change in this community? Please pray and consider whether God is leading you to partner with the PEB Higher Secondary School for its next extended season of education and service in Sangala Hill. We are so happy. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Dear Sangla lovers, today I am standing here at Sangla Hill School. My memory is taking me back to 1998 when the first time I visited the school. The building was in deplorable condition. The girls were sitting in verandas. The roofs were leaking. It was a hopeless situation. Young, bright-eyed girls were my only hope. Their sincere prayers were providing me strength. The journey from nowhere to here is a thrilling journey and a journey to this magnificent building is a journey of God's grace. It is a journey of God's people joining hands and it is a journey of your support and it is a journey of miracles happening. Our strength of working together has moved the mountains. Your continued support has really, friends, impacted many lives. Your support is helping us achieve our mission, vision and our goals. Your support is helping us now to focus on boys' education. The number of boys in the school is increasing. The boys' school is up till grade 8. It is moving to grade 9 and 10. Parents are requesting for more and more boys. We need to have a separate block for boys. Will you, dear friends, join hands now in building a new academic block for the boys? Thank you indeed for your love, your support, your generosity, and your help is making a lot of difference. May God bless you all. May God bless Pakistan. I always say, Pakistan, Zindabad.